it's a ray of sunshine. There's no doubt about that. <laughs> that is Kip Bancroft talking about his wife, Stacy. They have two kids together, and once their youngest one went off to college, they wanted to fill their empty nest by giving back. This is just amazing, and since Stacy has been in education for nearly 30 years, she noticed a need, and she realized it's been growing over the last couple of years. Kip trans helped her transform her vision into a reality. Oh, the sound of an elementary school first thing in the morning. happy and carefree. As little colorful feet hit the hallways, you really can't tell from here the struggle some students face at New Palestine Elementary School. We have some students who come with up to us with nothing. So they don't have clothes, they don't have a backpack or school supplies, and we're not okay with that. First grade teacher Stacy Bancroft definitely isn't okay with this. And so she talked to her husband Kip about the possibility of filling a closet for every child. We launched Stacy Sharing Closet. Together with the help of their two grown kids. This was our empty nest, yes. They transformed an old broom closet off of the cafeteria into a place where parents can shop with their kids for free. Brand new socks, brand new underwear, brand new pajamas. The clothing, it's brand new, it's gently used. Probably 10% of it still has tags on it. We put it in a nice shopping bag and off they go. Stacy's first sharing closet opened its doors last January. Since then, they created two more, one at Sugar Creek Elementary and another one at New Powell Junior High. So we've helped so far 35 families, 70 children, have given out almost 700 pieces of clothing. It gives you all the feels. Who doesn't love Spider-Man? gives a great deal of dignity to a family in need for them to be able to come in and shop from these shelves. And it's not just for students who go to Southern Hancock County schools. They have yet to turn anyone away. While the shopping experience is private, Stacy's sharing closet is making a noticeable difference. I see them smiling in the hallways and just being able to be kids, and that's what we want. You want to fill your time with meaningful things, and this has been is very meaningful for us. It's just been a labor of true love with everything that goes on with education today. This is just my heart. And I think it feels the same way. So if I could do this all the time and still be in the classroom and be effective, our hearts are full. Stacy oh. and Kip hope to bring a sharing closet to every single school in the district. They were also just recently contacted about possibly opening one in Knightstown, that too. That is so cool. If you'd like to schedule a shopping experience at Stacy's Sharing Closet, or if you're interested in donating, check out this story at WTHR.com. It's so cool to see somebody giving back in that way, and then with an opportunity for all of us to pitch in. And no doubt back. about it. I mean, really a true ray of sunshine on this yep. day that's rather dreary. 